What is going on ladies and gentlemen? We are here in Las Vegas, Nevada for a few things today. One, we're on vacation, we're celebrating uh, Hayes and Mine's anniversary, so we're just here exploring the sites, seeing what's up, having a great time, whatnot. But while we're in town, we decided to check out a few fun things that me and her would really enjoy. Um, we're not too big on going out to like the clubbing scene or like partying or anything. I mean, we do like to, you know, have a, a good, like a drink here and there and, you know, just enjoy the vibe. But uh, we are going to be checking out the future home of the permanent Halloween Horror Nights that the uh, Universal Theme Park and Resorts team is working on out here in Las Vegas, Nevada. And it's supposed to be at this place called Area 15. Now, if you guys are familiar with Area 15 or if you've ever heard of it, it's where the uh, famous Omega Mart is. Um, there's a lot of trippy stuff, a lot of like, you know, artsy kind of things there. So I'm excited to see what the space looks like. I'm excited to see how this experience is and, and whatnot. We also have a few other items on the agenda that we're gonna be trying to do the best to show you the best experience. Now, I know for one thing for sure, we're not gonna be able to take you guys in with us, but we will be doing the IT um, escape room. Yes, and that's gonna be a lot of fun. It's like 16 rooms. It's very immersive, interactive, based on IT chapter one uh, that came out a few years ago. So I'm excited to do that. That's gonna be a lot of fun. And then... They have chapter 2 coming soon. Chapter 2, yeah, it's coming soon. I don't know when it's supposed to drop. Maybe next year. I think they're going to let this one ride out for a little bit so people can experience it. But uh, they got that one. So we're going to be doing that one. We're going to be doing chapter 1 today. And then the one of the other things that we saw last night that caught our attention is they have an actual Stranger Things uh, pop-up store on the strip right now. So we're going to go check out the pop-up uh, store to see what they have. Uh, and, and it looks pretty cool from the outside. It was closed when we checked it out last night from the outside but we're gonna check it out today uh, so yeah a lot of fun stuff in Vegas come through with us we're gonna we're gonna have a great time uh, first stop area 15 we got into Omega Mart right now uh, place is really cool so fun fact we're employees we're employees now we're gonna go start at the ice cream scene. So fun fact about it is that you can actually buy stuff here with price tags. So I think it's really cool that it's an actual store as well on top of an experience, so that's really cool. We got this card, we're gonna go around and we got some interactive stuff to do. We're gonna start right here at the icy machine. What you got for us? The job training. That's what we were talking about. On job training. Confidential company data. All right, we figured it out. It was right right across from the slush. Complete your employee training right here. with a mega attitude. One day we might see you living the dream. Send it now.
challenge. We're crawling under the ladies and gentlemen. Full blown Call of Duty. Wow. Action shot right here. What me? <laughs> Got it? All right, we made it. Now we're going out of a tent back to Omega Mart. Can you go? Oh. Yeah, we're on the other side. Yeah. Now we say goodbye to Area 15. A very interesting place indeed. There's more experiences out there and I'd like to try to experience some more if we ever come back here, but there it is right there. Area 15 does That's not amazing. exist. That's the greatest catch line ever. But uh, yeah, it was pretty good. It was fun. Omega Mart was really cool. Good sci-fi experience. But now, we're going to go right across the street. Because right across the street from Area 15 is said to be the new location for the permanent Halloween Horror Nights. And there's a little, little circus stuff over there. There's a little circus thing going on. But the new permanent Halloween Horror Nights, it's going to be... Uh, right across the street in back of Area 15. We were just looking at the map schematics uh, and this is where we think it's going to be um, according to the concept map that they released. So let's go check it out. So as you can see, we're right around the corner from the new... Well, right behind. Right behind Area 15 right here. And it looks to be down right here. All this space is said to be the new location for the permanent Halloween Horror Nights right here. As you can see, they're flattening the ground right now so they can build it. Uh, this is supposed to be something huge. I'm excited for it. This is a good space for it. I would say about the only thing we got to do now is just work on the parking area, but it looks like it'd be a good solid space for a good little permanent year-round event. I'm super stoked for it. I know Hayes is super stoked for it. Very much so. So it's going to give us more reasons to come out to Vegas once this opens so we can kind of get an idea of what it is but here it is ladies and gentlemen the new <clears throat> lot that they are going to use for the new permanent Halloween Horror Nights it looks like right now they're breaking up ground and, and, and trying to get everything flattened up and ready to go but uh, it, it's a pretty good size area it really is looking at it now it's it's a really good size so I got a lot of potential for a lot of great things to be here on, on a Halloween Horror Nights level but it's looking great guys I can't wait to go through it can't wait to see it can't wait to see when it opens. We haven't gotten any word on a release date yet. They just announced the project that it's going to happen. So we shall see what uh, what comes out of that. But yeah, guys, that was the new location for the year-round Halloween Horror Nights that Universal Entertainment and Parks are putting on here in Las Vegas in partnership with Area 15. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we got done with Omega Mart at Area 15. Very uh, immersive experience, very good, a fun experience, a lot of uh, twists and turns and surprises every around every corner. I mean, there's literally... A lot of layers. A lot of layers, different, a lot of different layers. There's definitely like a lot of different separate entrances too, um, which I was really like kind of like tripping out about, but I thought it was a lot of fun. There's a lot of different interactive things for us to do, um, a lot of different little exhibits they had at Area 15. Um, within the, the uh, Omega Mart. Uh, they had some really cool merch that we picked up that was really cool. Um, so yeah, we just got done with that. I don't know what exactly what the plan is right now. We were just kind of driving right now. We're just happy to be sitting at the moment because we were standing for a good amount of time walking around going up and down stairs. Um, so now we're just kind of just happy to be in the car. I know we still have the IT experience to come up. That's later on tonight around 6 o'clock. And I know that um, we're going to check out the Stranger Things store as well. So that should be a lot of fun. Um, so let's let's see what we have on, on schedule. And we'll pick up when we figure out what we're going to do.